Good afternoon. Please give your attention to my associate, Agent J. He's going to demonstrate an electro-biomechanical neural transmitting zero synapse repositioner. We call it the Neuralizer. Keep it simple, Slid. Mm, thanks a lot. Thank you, Agent K. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you will, look right here. Okay, you know how you're on an airplane and the flight attendant asks you to turn your cell phone off? And you're like, I ain't turning my cell phone off. That don't have nothing to do with no damn airplane. Well, this is what we get. That's what happens. It gets up there, bounces around on the satellites, and blam! Just turn your damn cell phone off. Now you're gonna drive off a cliff tonight because your GPS don't work. May I have everyone's attention, please. Thank you. Okay, you know your kid won the goldfish in that little baggie from the school fair and you didn't want that nasty thing in your house, so you told your kid it ran away, but what you really did was flush it down the toilet? Well, this is what happens. Okay? See what I'm talking about? Don't lie to your kids. How are you, officers? What can I do you for? Well, look at this. Power windows, power seats, I bet you the thing costs six grand, man. Uh, yes, and it has a roof, but it's hidden. Hey, what kind of work do you do? An individual of your particular ethnic persuasion. Mmm. Maybe he's a noted athlete. Mmm. Yes. Uh, starting forward for the Detroit Darkies. Where'd you get the car? And the suit. I stole them both. A uh, car from your wife, suit from your grandmother. <clears throat> Hey, what do we have here? Concealed weapon? Hey, it's his grandmother's suit. Hey, what's this? It's probably drugs. Listen, I have rights, and I demand to see my lawyer before you press that small button on the side firmly. Press it. That gentleman is a standard issue neuralizer, but you're not gonna remember that. And just because you see a black man driving in a nice car does not mean it's stolen. I stole that one, but not because I'm black. I'm gonna be done with the car in a minute. Just find me to take it back to the jerk at the Rosenthal Hotel. Okay, just one last thing, an eye exam. That's not an eye exam, Kate. That's a big ass neuralizer. You sure have a lot of information for a fellow who doesn't know anything. I, I see what you're saying. Well, hey, you know what, Kay? We need to hold up a second. Kay! Let's just get this bike guard in here. Hey, back up. Back up. Kay, listen, I think we got off on the wrong foot, all right? So let's just stop for a second and talk. Don't put me in here, Kay. Too late, officer. Kay, no, listen to me. I can help you with this case. Kay! I'm doing the truth, face. You're missing it. Now, yeah, just use my imagination. Okay, the killer you're looking for, I'm after the same guy. He's a boglodyte. His name is Boris. Ship is sailed, amigo. Okay, if we don't get him now, it's gonna be two of them. Have yeah, my undivided attention. One gonna have one arm, one gonna have two. Okay, listen to me. If you erase me, you erase the whole world. 15 seconds to neuralization. 14, 13, 12. 11, 10, 9, when you see Bars eight, tomorrow, K, kill seven, him. Do not six, arrest him. Kill him. Five, four, three, two. Is this thing off? Hey, I don't think it's all the way off, K. It's whirring and buzzing. I don't know if I don't know nothing. I knew Roman. His wife cooked me dinner once, and while it was not pleasant, he was my friend. Last chance, who are you and what do you know? Am 
I'm an agent of Men in Black, but I'm from the future. We're partners. 25 years from now, you're gonna recruit me. And 14 years after that, the guy you didn't let me kill today at Coney Island, he escapes from prison and jumps back in the past and unleashes a full-scale invasion of Earth. We had about 19 hours to catch him and kill him, so really, we need to go right now. All right. 